Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and this is a video, as you can see, it's a bit of an update, a bit of a life update. I've been asked a couple of times on Twitter, where have I been? And you might have seen a lack of videos and just a lack of sort of me being around on YouTube and I know it's, for me, it's, it's really hard because I love YouTube so much but I wanted to give you you guys who have been so loyal and so wonderful and, and just anybody who's been wondering really an update into life. So first things first, um, I went on holiday at the beginning of August and when we came back I'd done um, every day July up to about the 27th I think on my blog so I had been so busy with that and I just felt that um, I needed a bit of a break from YouTube and I came back from holiday and I had two weeks in my current job, um, which I'll come on to later, I had two weeks and I had a, a really big deadline so I just had to prioritise work first and you guys know if you, this is my hobby, it's definitely not full time so sometimes work has to become a priority. The other thing that happened during that time was, um, I don't know whether you know but I've been working for the same company for quite a long time and um, a number of different roles within the organisation but I've been there eight years and this last position that I've been in has been a fixed term contract which means that um, I'm there from January to December that's when I got taken on it's not far from home which is really ideal but it isn't exactly what I've always wanted to do but it's also something that has challenged me and it's given me some new skills so it's been really welcome but it was never meant to be permanent um, I mean I could have continued on in the future um, if I really wanted to by you know looking for other roles within the business but I decided to look externally I think when you've been with a company for eight years sometimes you need a change and I love the company that I've worked for the last eight years and my feelings were now is the right time where I still have love for the company that if I go somewhere else and it really doesn't work out then at least I can you know get myself together and go back I feel like that's an option so you know fingers crossed I've made the right decision anyway the, the point is I have a new job and it starts at the beginning of October it's going to be a longer journey it's going to be it's a, it's a bigger deal actually I'm really really proud of myself for getting this job but not only that I just feel like I've got a lot to prove I've got a lot of time to dedicate so that's why I haven't been around I've been doing a lot of life stuff and life comes first YouTube does come second because it isn't my job it is my hobby oh Rupert's up here because I'm talking I think so that's what's happened there um secondly I've had um I've I've had um I lost a tooth in um just after holiday so I had a baby tooth that was due to come out you can't really see it when I'm talking but it's just there look so it's obviously really knocked my confidence that I'm you know doing beauty videos and now I don't have a tooth so I'm really conscious about it not too bad like when I talk I don't see it and hopefully you guys don't see it either um it's only when I sort of smile on this side it's quite obvious but hopefully it's not too obvious but it was a baby tooth it was due to come out for the last three and a half years when I you know knocked it and it has been it has been a three and a half years of just solid fear that it's going to come out and it did eventually I'm sort of happy that it has it means that now I've got options on what to do next I don't know what that's going to look like but I do know that it's going to cost an absolute fortune because when you lose a tooth like this you can either get a denture which is still a lot of money and also isn't well it's not permanent is it and it's not quite, not very nice really or you can have an implant which costs about two thousand pounds a tooth and that is just money that I just don't have right now but it's something to think about and I've got options I don't feel like I look absolutely horrendous without this tooth so at the moment I'm living with it and hopefully I don't get too much oh you haven't got a tooth and um, you know whatever it's just one of those things that happened it was a baby tooth it had to come out and I do have a tooth up there it's not pushing it's not working its way down I doubt that will ever happen because it would if it was going to it would have happened before so that's the second thing that's happened um thirdly I have for the last eight years had a company car that will no longer be mine um I've 
you know been really lucky to have that option and sorry about the lighting by the way I've got the sun's going down it's quite late and you know what it's like in the winter well it's not winter yet but you know what I mean <laughs> in the autumn so um I'm having to, I've had to buy a new car what that means is my salary although you know it has increased marginally um it's I've been able to afford a car but everything that comes with it as well so things like buying makeup and purchasing loads of makeup is not going to happen as much but I'm looking at different things that I can do with my current stash different videos that I can do and different look I could start doing more looks you know I've got that much makeup I should really start really trying to do things with my makeup that I've got I don't have to always show hauls it was it's because I really enjoy that sort of video that I did them so I think for moving forward with the channel I do still want to continue to do two videos a week if I can it might have to just decrease to one at the moment my blog I am really enjoying doing still I had that started in November last year so the fact that it's still going I feel really proud of that and it's doing really really well so um, all reviews of products will always be on my blog I will review everything is reviewed I don't really do much else I do sometimes a wish list um, I try and do some edits now and again but honestly it's mainly reviews of products and I've really enjoyed doing that so head over there www.leahxl.com but also on the YouTube channel I just want to make the videos a bit more sharp I just want to make them videos that people want to watch so let me know what you think is two videos what you want I'm happy to do that but I, I might have to just start with one I might have to take it down to like on a Sunday only and I'm sure lots of people are fine with that lots of people do YouTube with one video a week so you know it's still 52 videos a year and there may be some weeks or some months where I do extra special ones you know like every day may I really enjoy doing that so yeah let's have a think between us you know we're a community tell me what you want to see but I really just wanted to bring you this update now um, and finally, um, yeah, so job update, um, finally mother and kidney update. Um, as you all know, I did a really heartfelt video about losing weight to give my mum a kidney. So unfortunately, I don't think from what the doctors are saying that that is going to be an option. I don't think a transplant is going to be an option moving forward. At the moment, it's looking like dialysis only and dialysis is only, it's not infinite basically. It's not an infinite possibility. And uh, it does mean that I'm sort of preparing myself for the worst. I don't really want to talk about it too much. I feel like it might be another subject I can talk about another time. If you've got any questions, I would like to answer them. I'm happy to answer them. But, you know, from what mum's saying and from what the doctors are saying, I just, I'm preparing myself for the worst. Now she's not ill, but it can switch really quickly. And that's the biggest concern for me. And it, you know, for me, I live so far away from my mum, not loads of miles, but I'm an hour away in the car. And we don't visit as regularly as I would like. So I need to concentrate on that as well, which is why YouTube has taken a back seat. So there really is a number of personal reasons and I don't have to explain them. And I know I don't have to justify my reasons, but you guys have been such a, a rock for me. You've been a place that I can share my love for things. And you can also, I feel like I can talk to you all. So that's really the update. So new job, new car, um you know stuff with mum lost tooth <laughs> um yeah I guess that's where we are so I wanted to give you all a massive huge thank you for just sticking with me um and I hope you will stick with me going forward this is essentially a beauty channel it will stay that way I will continue to maybe throw in some let's talk videos now and again but to be honest I really need to concentrate on my job which is really important, my blog, which I'm absolutely loving, and, um, you know, my, my family, and I'm sure you are all more than happy to stick with me, I, and I know that, you're all so amazing, so thank you so, so, so much for watching, I hope that this has answered some questions if you were wondering what was going on, and 
hopefully there'll be some awesome videos coming up soon. Like I say, I've been really brainstorming some good ideas of what I can do without having to haul all the time. So yeah, please, 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 if you've got any suggestions, I would love to see them. So thank you so, so much for watching. Um, if you haven't subscribed, then please do if you want to. If you don't want to, it doesn't matter anyway. And if you would like to give this a thumbs up, then please do. If you want to give it a thumbs down, that's entirely up to you. They don't bother me, to be honest. And yeah, I will see you in the next video. And of course, comment because I love that. So see you all soon, guys. Bye.